Hello and welcome to Phoenix's building of the Hello Baby cot bed. Take the side lattice piece and insert the two wooden pegs at either end. Only do this to one side of the lattice piece. Then take the second lattice piece and do the same as you did for the first by inserting the wooden pegs into the holes and making sure that they're all the way down. When you have done this, take the base end of the cot bed and take the side lattice piece with the wooden pegs and slot it into the two holes. Do this with both the lattice pieces with the ends where the wooden pegs are sticking out. Now stand it up as if it was standing and put the base head of the screw into the hole as being demonstrated. Then take the long metal screw, insert it into the hole and using the angle key turn it until it's flush against the wood. Do this for all the four holes as being shown to you on the video. When you have completed that Take these pieces that are demonstrated and start putting them into the base plate. Take the long screw and put it through the bottom. Then take the pin and face it towards you. Add the circle and then screw the screw head onto the top. When you have fixed it, make sure the pin is sticking out towards you. When you have done this to both sides of the base plate, you can fix it on to the headboard. There are two slots for the base plate of the cot bed, a high one and a low one. This is done by your preference and how old your baby is. When you have added the base plate, then proceed to put the pins in the holes as demonstrated. When you have done this, take the second headboard and slot them into the holes provided. Make sure that you put all the holes with the right pins and push down firmly. When you have fixed the top headboard, then you will proceed to screw it in. As being demonstrated, you put the end of the screw in the hole in the lattice work, then take the long metal screw through the hole and screw it into the bottom. Now do this for all the four screw holes that are provided. Now open the second box and take out the end shelf and insert the wooden pins in all the holes. Now take it to the base plate or the headboard otherwise known as and press firmly all the way through. Now take the long spiraled screws and fix all the way in until flush against the wood. And do this to both sides. Now we will start construction on the drawer of the cot bed. Take the small wooden pins and insert them into the four slots except the ends. Now do this to the identical piece of wood in the exact same holes. When you have done that, take the side board and insert the two longer wooden pins into the two middle holes on both sides. Then take the two pieces that we prepared earlier and put them in the corresponding holes on the sideboards. boards. 
Make sure that they are pushed all the way in. Now take the long wooden pins and insert them into the two side holes, not the middle. Make sure that they are pushed all the way in. Now take the screw. Do you have pushed it and screwed it flush against the wood? leaving the end of the screw standing up. Now do it to the center and the ends to both head, head and backboard of the drawer. Now take the sideboards that we prepared earlier and put them down the sides. Then take the thin piece of plywood and slot it into the groove provided. Then take the other piece that we prepared earlier and push it flush in. Now take the screw end, push it all the way in and screw it fast. Do this to both sides. Now take the long, longer and wider piece of plywood with the handles and put into the grooves provided. Now do this with the baseboard of the drawer as well. When you have done all this, now take the other headboard of the, of the drawer and push it into the holes that are provided. Push down firmly to fasten. Take the screw as demonstrated and screw the baseboard to the drawer itself. Attaching the wheels is done by placing the wheel on the drawer base and screwing fast. If you'd like any further information about the Hello Baby cockpit, then please visit www.finic.co.uk.